What's up, everyone? Thanks for checking out This Week in Cloud, where we serve you the lowest latency news. Our Google Cloud Platform region in Zurich is now live and ready for business. Let's do this with numbers. It's our sixth European region and our 19th worldwide. And the Zurich GCP region comes with three availability zones. But the coolest number? Hosting applications here can improve latency for Swiss end users by up to 10 milliseconds. You'll have access to our flagship products such as Google Compute Engine, Google Kubernetes Engine, BigQuery, and so on. But best of all, thanks to Cloud Interconnect, you can even access the services that aren't available in Zurich yet by connecting to other regions over the Google network. Try it out and reach end users worldwide. You might know that Google wrote the book on site reliability engineering. And now we're adding some new chapters. We've just added a new Coursera course on SRE to help engineers design and manage complex systems that meet their reliability targets. Basically, it distills everything we've learned through trial and error about SRE since we coined the term itself. These best practices are tried and true, so check them out. Not sure where to get started on these best practices? Our Google Cloud partners have access to lots of great resources, including helping you discover new solutions for your customers and new channels for your business with Google Cloud. Our SLO guide is a free resource for our partners to help companies discover what they should measure based on common architectures and critical user journeys. So if you want to see what being a Google Cloud partner can do for you, take a look at the path to becoming a partner. Speaking of better SRE, have you tried out Istio and see how it can support your SRE practices? Check out this awesome blog from our Istio series to discover how to easily surface application metrics with Istio and Stackdriver monitoring. You'll even learn how to track the progression of a single request as it's handled by our other services in your deployment with Stackdriver Trace, while Stackdriver logging can give you a more complete picture of what your app is doing at all times. Read the blog post and try out the hands-on tutorial for yourself. If you want to read more about these announcements or see a full list, check out the link. Have thoughts or ideas? Leave us a comment or tweet us. We'll see you in the cloud.